everyone. Today is a sad day. So, last night, Akira Toriyama has passed away. He died of a thing for from his brain and whatever. It's like a disease with his brain where it would bleed and everything. Yeah, he unfortunately passed away. Unfortunately. Yeah, so, this isn't going to be too long of a video. I just want to talk about a couple things. First off, I just want to say to all of Akira Toriyama's fans, his family and everyone, he had a great life with us. He made, all, he made a lot of anime series. All of the games have been out based off his stories. He's been a great person for this, for eight, yeah, 68 years, I'm supposed to say 84 years, or 86, but he's been out for 80, he's been making things for 68 years, or, well, he's been alive for 68 years, I don't know about making any sort, but the point is, he's been around for that long, and the first anime, excluding the Pokemon anime, which technically that's not made by Akira Toriyama, it actually was Dragon Ball, and when I watched Dragon Ball, that's when I got into, like, anime. That's how I got to anime, so, yeah, basically, Akira Toriyama, with his Dragon Ball Z, I watched Dragon Ball Z Kai when it was on Nickelodeon, and it was awesome. It was so good, and then eventually I watched some other animes, and that's how I got into playing anime games. That's how I kind of got into, like, anime and into Dragon Ball itself. I watched, I think I've watched majority of the Z movies. I, I don't think I've watched, like, the OG Dragon Ball movies. I know what happens in them, I just haven't seen them myself. Like, I haven't watched them. Yeah. But, man. It's such a, it's so sad. He's been making anime for, a, I don't know how long, but for a very long time. Like, since the 80s, when he made the OG Dragon Ball, that was when he made, that's when his anime career started. Was it in, like, the 80s? <clears throat> so, I want to say he'd be in the 20s? Maybe, maybe in the late teens? I don't know. But, yeah. So, again... Dragon Ball was the anime that was made by Akira Toriyama that got me into to anime and also into the into basically watching anime entirely like every kind of anime. Yeah. It's so sad and man I I I I really don't know what to say, but I've been seeing a lot of Dragon Ball fans devastated about this. A lot of them are just devastated by this news. Like, Burkhol is devastated. I haven't seen his video yet, but I probably will watch it after this video just to see. Because I know what I watched, like, the first, I guess, few seconds of it. Or almost a minute of it. And I know he's pretty upset. Yeah, like, well, uh, yeah, I, I on Twitter, he, it's been trending with about him, and everyone has just been honoring him, and yeah, so, you will be missed, Akira Toriyama, you will be missed, and hopefully, your soul will be rested, can be rested, and... Hopefully you'll get to see some cool stuff in heaven. As, and maybe you'll come back one day. One day and create a whole new anime that we've never seen before. Yeah, so rest in peace Akira Toriyama. And I'm going to end this video here. 
I'll see you guys for my stream playing Call of Duty Black Ops 3 later on today. If I decide to, because I don't know. I still have some stuff I gotta do, so... Yeah, bye everyone.